All right, today we're getting started on this turn of the century guitar, 1900 to 1920 uh, parlor guitar. Looks like somebody has uh, changed the machines out at some point, which is uh, likely because they wear out after a while. Looks like the top has got a shim on it. That crack has been glued not touched up but the big problem is the uh, brace on the inside is completely loose except for the end and another brace further down is missing completely so we're going to have to take the back off so we can make a new brace to fit We've already got started on part of it was already loose as you can see right here. Yeah, this was loose. This side was mostly loose. We've got it loosened it further. But we'll keep going around the side here very carefully. With some hot water, and spatulas. Sometimes it'll just pop loose like that. But you got to be careful that the grain doesn't split. So we'll go out from two directions. Put a little more hot water in there. And of course the neck block there. It's also going to be a spot that's going to be tricky. Oh, looks like we got it pretty close up here. takes a while to work sometimes. Popped all of a sudden right there. So looks like we got most of it done. Most of the back is loose now. Just holding right there at the neck block. slowly and carefully. Sometimes we will use a knife to break the glue bond there. Oh yeah, we got to be careful it wants to split right there. We don't want that to split. So we will just take this very carefully. These are specially sharpened. This one used to be as long as this one, but broke. Sometimes the shorter one's more effective anyway.
Yeah, this is the trickiest part. You're tempted to go fast and just rip it apart. But that will uh, cause other problems. Oh, there we go. That's actually, oh, here's the little brace. It stayed slightly attached there, but this one's missing. That one's loose. No way we could have got to that. Nice rosewood back though. And we'll inspect the insides here. Oh, a lot of dirt and dust up here. Something could have been a mouse mouse nest. You can see that top crack repair. Another one there. Looks like it came out pretty well. That other little crack there, we'll have to glue that up. But the top braces all seem to be intact, that's good. So we will re revisit that in our next segment. We'll clean this up and glue it back and make a new brace for the top there, or the back there. Thanks for watching.